Hey viewers, those of you who watch my videos, you know I love my impact tools. In some of my videos, I've been using a half inch Kawasaki impact wrench. Uh, I got that at a garage sale for like 35 bucks. It's rated for 220 foot pounds of torque, but a lot of people say that that's overrated and it's not that powerful. But it's been doing a pretty good job. But I've been wanting something a little bit more serious, and so I've been watching Craigslist, and I saw this on there on Craigslist listed for 40 bucks, which I thought that's a great deal. But it was nowhere near where we live. But it was near where we were going to be camping for the weekend. So I contacted the guy, said, hey, I'd like to come out and see that. So we made arrangements. It was about a 30-minute drive from where we, were, where we were camping. So I drove down and got down there and looked at it. It's a bit dirty, but it seems like it's in good, solid shape. I asked him why he was selling it. He said he was upgrading to like a Milwaukee fuel cordless uh, impact wrench. And I, well, I can see that. You know, so he said he doesn't need this. Well, it had been listed on Craigslist for nearly a month. You know, so I was like, hmm, okay, 40 bucks. Why has it been listed on there for months? So I asked if he'd got much interest. He said, well, people contact him, but then nobody would actually come out. You know, it's just, you know, so maybe he's a little bit far out in the boonies where he was uh, at. So we plugged it in. It spun, you know, good. I don't know how, uh, you know, I wasn't able to tell how good the impact stuff on, but it did, you know, fire up. That's good. So seeing it had been listed on there for a month, I said, hey, you know, are you flexible on price? And 40 bucks was a great deal, but I was like going, you know, our flexible on price. And he goes, yeah, he would. You know, what are you thinking? I'm saying, would you take 30 bucks for it? And I was expecting him to say, no, he wouldn't take 30, maybe settle at 35. But he kind of paused for a little bit and said, yeah, he'd take 30. So I got this DeWalt DW292 corded impact wrench for 30 bucks. Now, this thing is rated for 345 foot-pounds, so it's quite a bit more powerful than the Kawasaki. So, I think this would just be a lot of fun to use. So, let's go ahead and plug it in and try it out and see how well it works as an impact wrench. So, as a test, I'll remove a uh, fixed cup, which some of these can be on there pretty good. I have my little tool that I made uh, to, from removing fixed cups. I have a video on uh, this. I'll include a link down in the description. You should go check that out. Anyway, let's go ahead and see how this thing works. Make sure it's spinning the right way. And it's probably going to need to tighten on there a little bit uh, first, but when it grabs, then let's see how, how well it goes. And there it goes. Yeah, it definitely has some nice power to it. Uh, so anyway, 30 bucks for a nice DeWalt impact wrench. I think this is just gonna be a ton of fun to use. And this just goes to show you, you don't need to spend a fortune on tools. If you go ahead and watch like Craigslist and Facebook Marketplace and other types of places like uh, Let Go and other things like that, um, you can find tools out there if you're patient and watch. So anyway, what do you guys think? Let me know down in the comments. Hopefully you found this video useful or interesting. If you did, please give it a thumbs up. If you're not subscribed to my channel, click the subscribe button. Be sure to click the bell so you get notified when new videos come out. I'm over on Facebook, RJ the Bike Guy. Go over there and like that page. I post a lot of stuff over there. It's a lot of fun. Anyway, thank you guys very much for watching. It's going to be fun. Ha 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 ha. Power. Ha.